a really solid performance from Joe and Katie. Geez, she looks so limber and loose. Looks really free in how she's surfing. Uh, looking forward to these semi-finals. They're going to be incredible. He's also on the backhand, so he's going to have that going for him as well. So we see a little bit of hustle here at the beginning, and Maddie McGillivray gets the best of it, and uh, will pay off. Nothing doing there, and then Cole. He got this one outside. This is this power backhand display and whoa, goes over the handlebars. New faces everywhere and uh, far out. This is a, a really good heat. You've got a, a big, thick unit block of a man in Kyle Houseman who can put it together real smooth. And then you've got this live wire, Matty McGilvray, who has actually, if I think about his highlight moments from this event so far, he's been bringing some power moves as well. Well, let's see what he can do with this one as he rolls through to the inside. Get some release in that tail from our uh, from our men's semi-final. This is that replay. Matty tidied it up here. So this guy, for me, just ultra consistent, but also unpredictable. This guy just constantly surprises you with his approach. Really smooth. Gets the turns done, but then he throws these wild airs and mm. these crazy blocks. On the championship tour, Cole Hausman on the outside. Good bowl setting oh. up here. And he unloads one of those beautiful, smooth backhand power hits before this wave comes to a close. So plenty of uh, time to enjoy these two competitors going at it, Rich. Uh, what are the weapons for both these competitors and who, who has the edge in these conditions? So you go, what? Where did that come from? Yeah, and Cole... Far out. He's got all this power, which we talk about a lot, but the way that he links stuff together, the smoothness of it, it reminds me a lot of his coach yeah. back on tour. You know, a big body, but able to not just obliterate sections with, like, this sort of thuggy, messy style. He really puts it together beautifully. There's so much, like, just connection in the way that he, he links everything. And uh, far out. He's been so fun to watch this week. He's been absolutely ripping, uh, and we're waiting on scores to come through from the opening exchange. 6.77. Rich, take us through it. Yeah, clicks on that first turn and then really squares up on that second one. Throws a ton of spray skyward there. Stays with the energy all the way through to the inside. Tags it again. So, uh, well, you talk about strength, strengths, Ron, and, and this is what this guy has. He can square up on these sections when they pop up. And a uh, little slip up there, but, geez, he got some work done on that on that outside. Oh, man, the more you watch him surf, the more you think his name's going to look pretty much not out of place on that Bill's trophy. <laughs> the way that he's able to just power through the lip, uh, how deep his bottom turn is, it's a thing of beauty. Like, I just love watching a goof, especially on that Bell's Bowl when it presents itself absolutely go at it. And Kyle got a good one on this wave. Yeah, last goofy foot up left in the event now can see just stayed on top of that little white water section projecting down the line Look at that. drags that inside um, pivots around it really gets that tail release off the lip there sets his uh, heel side edge again straight into another smooth bottom to he's keeping that flow going just connecting these turns so beautifully which is it's actually really hard to do in these sort of disjointed ways now that the winds come up those little in-between, just off the lips when there's a tiny bit of coping, just throw so much spray. They're, they're awesome. It's like building a, you know, a house of cards, though, and then putting the final card on top and having the whole thing crumble down at the end there, just missing that final move. Yeah, so another good-looking wave for Cole Houshman here. Streaks down the line, cracks that first section, does well to uh, manage all those bumps. Comes around, just gets a little stuck on this one. Squares that one up a lot better. Catches that uh, toe side edge. So Cole just goes, no, nah, I'm out of here. And we see Matty McGilvray now. Just waited it with his priority for the uh, the ultimate opportunity. And he's used it on a wave that just hasn't really given him anything. Not even a big ramp to attack on the end section. We'll come back to uh, that point in a moment as we see Cole now. Back on the uh, attack here. Trying to get rid of a 5.23. Smooth flow and oh, just uh, assaulting the bowl here as he uh, starts to roll this one right through to the inside. Just chipping away at it. Not a whole lot to work with, but we'll see if he can make something of this. Nice little flare on the tail. Yep. He likes the feel of that. So Cole takes off. And uh, it was a real game of patience here. Gets this first re-entry in and then he just... See so yeah, how we just time this second turn and then this third one here. This is the money shot. Bang. Hammers it. Gets the tail drift. 
backs it up perfectly. Keeps all that flow and speed into the fourth turn and just does a little rail work all the way uh, to tidy things up for that opener. Uh, sorry, the closing finish off the foam. Yeah. Jeez, there's, there's, not a, there's not a surfer out there who's watching this broadcast who didn't go Pwah! when they <laughs> saw that backside snap. Like, full emotional reaction to it. I'm emotional, Rich. Yeah, great extension. Watch this. Now he compresses, throws it right up there. That's what we call squaring up. Gets that board right at 12 o'clock. It's a little tail release and drift as he comes down, re-engages, straight back on the heel side. Matty McGillivray going, oh, shot. But it looks like he's going to wave the white flag, congratulate Cole Hauschman on a well-earned victory here as this one comes to a close. And the rookie is into his first final on the championship tour. Wow. Unbelievable. What so a performance sick. from 26th place on the rankings. Already up 10 spots and no doubt climbing a couple of more with, with this semi-final win.